Hi all, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to do your daily vibes for Saturday, August 4th. This is for whoever it resonates with. If it feels right, it's right. If it feels wrong, it's wrong. This is the energy that I'm picking up on today. The timing is fluid. Two of Wands, a decision. Maybe making a sudden decision. Ace of Wands, a passionate new beginning. Now it looks like there's a door opening. There's a new door opening. This could be a new partnership. Something that is very exciting. Has a lot of growth, very fiery. Strength. Strength to go through that new door. Five of Swords reversed. Letting go of ego. Six of Swords upright. Moving on. Yeah, somebody's deciding to go through a new door. And this may be a sudden decision. Perhaps you've been given this new opportunity. You've been offered this new opportunity. To change your direction. And you decide to go for it. Uh, it's not worth staying where I'm at. I'm going to go for it. Yeah, somebody is moving to something better. Eight of Swords. Been trapped for quite some time. High Priestess reversed. <sighs> taking the next step. Yeah, definitely taking that next step. So let me get this focused in. Somebody has stalled way too long with the hangman. They've stalled this awakening. They've stalled this eye-opening. You know, they've been needing to see things from a new perspective, but refusing to do so. But I feel like now somebody is deciding to go through a new door. I'm no longer going to stay trapped in fear, trapped in my mind. There's been a loss of self. No, somebody hadn't been listening for quite some time, not listening to their inner guide, not wanting to follow the chosen path, thinking that they could control it. And now it's like, you know, I'm ready to take this next step. You know, we have the two of coins with the two of wands. This is a choice, a decision, a, ch a decision that brings balance. I'm ready to, to regain the balance that's been lost. There's... A feeling of flexibility. I'm, I'm ready to do whatever I have to do to get to the other side. It's no longer worth hanging on. It's no longer worth it. The Five of Swords reversed with the Hangman reversed. It's no longer worth hanging on. Somebody has come to that conclusion and they're going to the other side. I'm headed towards the other side. They've found the strength. Now, the Seven of Cups over here is a complex decision. And that's where this this uh, uh, hanging on, that's what it was done. It's been a complex decision to let go and to move on. But somebody has made that decision to do so. For the Six of Swords. I don't want to be stuck here anymore. So somebody is. They have. And so this is the opposite of yesterday. Thank you, God. The new door ha is opening the two of wands with the six of cups or the six of swords uh, mirroring each other. Somebody has moved on 
and the new door is now open. The light is shining through. A golden opportunity. Leaving, leaving the storm behind, leaving the trouble behind, leaving the darkness behind. Because they decide to, to find the strength to do so, there's a new passionate beginning waiting for them. I believe that there's been a, an offer, or there's going to be an offer. And it, this offer may be too hot to pass up. This feeling of being trapped and keeping, keeping yourself bound and tied, you allowed that, has caused a feeling of repression and loss of self. But I feel like now somebody is moving closer to the other side. They are with this two of pentacles. So today is a day of, of really, really opening up letting go. Somebody has let go. They have. Let's get some more cards. This Seven of Cups is a card of consequences. Okay, right here. Holding on has brought a lot of, of consequences. Some of them good, some of them bad. The good consequences are enlightenment. Somebody has been enlightened. They're not the same person. This hanging on has given them the, the knowledge of who they really want to be. This, this holding on has also caused a, a loss of self. And that these days totally fall right in line. This loss of self has sparked an awakening. That's what's happened. And now somebody is deciding to take the next step to get to the other side. They found the strength. Yeah, there's victory and success coming towards with a relationship, happiness, bliss, because somebody has decided to make some compromises. And let go of the hidden agendas. You know, you were probably hanging on to something that you couldn't manifest for quite some time with a magician reversed. But somebody has found the courage to put their effort in a new direction. That's what it looks like to me. And happiness is here because somebody is taking the next step. But for those of you that have truly moved on, there's victory and success. There's a transformation that has happened that is bringing something new into your life because you have taken the lead. There's a lot of inner strength here. And now somebody has decided that I'm, I'm ready for this new opportunity. Seriously, there's a new passionate opportunity right here. Could be with a Cancer, could be with a Leo. Could be with a Gemini, could be with a Pisces. There's definitely options, and somebody has come to that conclusion. I have options. So if you are being offered a new passionate beginning with somebody, it could lead to a lot of happiness and victory. That's when you, when you let go. You let go of the power struggles, the five of wands reversed. It's when you stop playing the game with yourself. When you take that blindfold off and free yourself from the the mental conflict that has been holding you back. It's like you feel relief, you receive this new opportunity. I have decided to replace fear with faith and go through this new door. 
And because you step into that light, you step through that new path, there is a, there's a very passionate, exciting, adventurous opportunity right there, right there, that promises growth and happiness and balance. But it's because you put in effort to do so. You find the strength to put in effort. And be logical. And make a solid, firm decision. It feels like you are no longer going to let your... Let anybody else get in the way of your decision. It's like my decision has been made. I'm seeing this situation absolutely clearly now after I've been confused for way too long. This could be, you know, memories of the past. This could be somebody from your past. You could be receiving communication for those of you that are, you know, wanting that. I feel like for a lot of you, this is a new passionate beginning with someone new. But for some of you, it could be with somebody from your past. It could be. Somebody lets go of their ego with the Five of Swords reversed. That is an ego card. It's when they step out of their ego and perhaps communicate. You could have been dealing with a situation. Well, somebody was trying to manipulate. Somebody was trying to deceive whether they were deceiving themselves or you were being deceived with another from another person the magician reverses is, is deception trickery cunning lies somebody is moving away from that with the six of swords right next to it has made a decision or is in the process of making a decision to let go of the deception like take the mask off in regards to something from the past All I want is to be happy. The Five of Swords reverse. All I want is to be happy. Somebody is acting with integrity. It's time to do the right thing. They're finding the courage to do the right thing. Replacing fear with faith. That's pretty prominent here. Which brings happiness and a exciting new beginning into your life. Somebody was in their head for quite some time trying not to accept the truth. Doing everything to just stay there because it was comfortable. But now they've found the, the faith to, to head in a new direction. They had shut themselves off from love. This is the Knight of Cups reversed. With the Knight of Coins reverse, stalled, stopped it, procrastinated way too long. But it feels like now they're, now, you see where these are lined up, now somebody is finding the strength and the confidence. To find happiness, instead of stalling and shutting themselves off from love, I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready. I've found the strength to make an offer or accept an offer. Somebody's, this, this whole process has been delayed because somebody was trapped in their mind, trapped in their head, mentally trapped, going through some mental turf, turmoil, refusing to see the light, refusing to take the blindfold off, to, refusing to see the, the truth of the matter. Now they realize that that's not the responsible thing to do. That's not the practical thing to do. It's not leading to any relationship. And I have to replace the fear with faith and find the courage and the confidence to bring happiness back to my life. And take that blindfold off. Somebody is taking the lead. Now, somebody could even be getting in their vehicle and coming in your direction because this is a vehicle. 
And that's a new passionate beginning. So you could be getting an offer from someone. Somebody shows right up at your door. There's a door. That could be the case. And it could lead to happiness. But I see that you're very independent at this time. You're very abundant. Stable. Secure. There's a lot of self-love. There's a lot of self-worth. Enjoying life. Doing great. Doing fine. And perhaps you, you allowed something to just dissipate. You stopped investing in something that wasn't growing. Perhaps there was a one-sided situation where there was an equal give and take and now somebody has woken up. Somebody has woken up. Awakening. Somebody wants another chance or they want a chance. Whether it's the first chance, the second chance, the third chance, the fourth chance. I don't, I don't know. It doesn't matter. Somebody wants a chance. Perhaps forgiveness is needed. Somebody is, is making a judgment call. Trying to do the right thing. After they have been mentally trapped for a long time, they've been they've re, been awakened. Somebody has woken up. So I feel like you, there there could be some communication that is coming in from somebody, whether it's somebody new or somebody old, as somebody has found the mental strength to do the right thing, to step outside of their fear. With the chariot and the eight of swords, somebody is stepping outside of their fear, stepping outside of their head. And that new door is, is, is open. The new path is open. So I feel like there is a, going to be a complex decision that needs to be made in regards. And, and for some of you, this will resonate. For some of you, it will not. This is, this is the past, the six of cups. There's been some deception, there's been some lies, as we've dealt with, somebody has dealt with a tricky individual. And now they may have to make a complex decision whether they want to allow this to resurface or not. That's for some of you. We need a clarifier over here. Oh, Queen of Cups. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Somebody wants to offer love. They've opened their heart. This is male or female. This could be somebody from your past. Okay. They just want to be happy. Page of Pentacles. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. You know, somebody may be wanting to offer an apology. Maybe they realize that... They weren't doing the right thing. There's lack of integrity here, and now they just want to be happy. Somebody had lost their focus, but they've been enlightened. I can see that they've been enlightened now. They've been through some sort of awakening. They've learned some new skills. And now they're, they may be coming to communicate as they are starting, or they are seeing things clearly. So I feel as though there is a, a chance here. But forgiveness is needed. Forgiveness is needed. Now, there is a new partnership for those of you that want new or old. There's a new passionate beginning right here, ready. But strength is big. The strength to accept it. The strength to trust. The strength to have faith in this passionate beginning. Do you have the strength to accept it? To go through this new door? Somebody has received it as some sort of epiphany that says, you know what? It's time for me to head in that new direction or that direction that my heart desires. Somebody is taking the lead, taking back control of their life. And 
jumper. Somebody's taking the lead, being responsible, has made a decision, has gained a lot of wisdom through whatever it is that they've been through, and is ready to take back control. Somebody is taking back control of their life and going through a new door, opening a door. So I feel like today is a day of somebody actually really moving forward. Finding the courage, the strength, the confidence. To forgive and move on. We're going to get one of these. <laughs> so funny. Strength. I mean, we have a lot of strength here. We really do. We have a lot of strength. This is a card of strength. Here we have strength, and here we have strength. Somebody has found the strength that has been lost for so, so long. Strength comes from many sources. Staying strong brings confidence, conviction, and a balanced body, mind, and soul. Spirit has its own unique and beautiful way of replenishing your soul with strength on a continual, continual basis. You're never really alone, as we are always with you. You know, somebody from the other side could be guiding you, because a judgment card can signal somebody from the other side guiding you towards victory and success. Either way, there's a passionate new beginning here, a new partner, or a reconciliation with someone from the past even. Because somebody finds the strength to do the right thing. That's what I see. Whatever that right thing is, or to follow their heart. Maybe even apologize. I don't know. I know there's a lot of people in this world that cannot apologize. It takes strength to apologize. Even if you're not forgiven. Even if you're not forgiven for whatever you did. That's true wisdom. When you can apologize and, and walk away. I don't know where that's coming from, but whatever. Um, anyway, I feel like there's, there's an opportunity for a passionate new beginning here for those of you that have mastered your emotions enough to get to the other side. Okay. Get to the other side. He's on a trapeze. Somebody is finding the strength to, to get to the other side. To keep walking. To do what they need to do. To hold on. And now they've decided, I just want to be happy. All I want is my happiness back. So, you know, this Six of Swords is heading into the situation. Normally on decks, it's headed out. It's headed in. Somebody could be headed back into your life. Because they've stepped out of their ego. This will not resonate with everybody, like I said, because there are some people that refuse to apologize. And I don't know where that's coming from. And then there are people that will not accept an apology. So this will not resonate with everybody. <laughs> For some of you, there's a new passionate beginning with somebody brand new. Brand new. But you will need to have the strength to accept it. Because perhaps you never got the apology that you deserved. Because somebody didn't get what they deserved. The six of coins reversed. Never got the apology that you deserved from whoever it is that whatever. And so now you have to have the strength to accept the new opportunity. Because you, you didn't get what you didn't. There was no closure. There was no apology from the last one. Whatever. However this resonates with you. It could go so many ways. It's time to move on. To a much better place that brings happiness with that Ten of Cups and Bliss. And there's an opportunity for it now. 
if someone can master their emotions and head in that direction. Talk to you later.